Hello, this is Shadow Wolf Prime and and Alan, and we're back with another one of my TNT statues. This one is my TNT statue. Yes, quite literally, and this is my last one that I've made ever. And quite frankly, it's my most effective. I have a quite literally a couple thousand blocks of TNT inside this monster, and, and I'm going to try to survive it. Yes. Let me go ahead and fly up there so we can see what it looks like. It looks like the block of TNT, the, the TNT item in Minecraft. Except for, well, I wish I had darker orange. But besides that, I also got the top looking like a TNT block. More, more or less. This is quite easily my longest one to build, more or less. And Mr. Allen is down there building his safe bunker, supposedly. I, I, I'm i gonna tell you, th th this you're, you're gonna die probably in 10 to 1. Ah, Obsidian's supposed to be strong. Well, yeah, but that shouldn't... That, but still, you have to account oh, for the... water. <laughs> you have to account for the blast radi the blast effect. Well, I'll account for that when I'm alive at the end. I'll go ahead and get me some item. A TNT should be good to set it off. And, um... More water. Flint and steel. I'll go ahead and put the TNT in here for now. And I'll set it off when you're done. Hello, Mr. Gray Sheep. How are you today? The way I make these uh, TNT statues is I take a picture of the item I'm going to recreate. I'm gonna I, I take a screenshot of it, and then from what I do there, I count each and every pixel of it or block inside. Or, or, yeah, let's call it a pixel. Count each and every one. So each and every one of these pixels is how big this thing is, wide and high, and and so forth. And that's how I make my statues. This one is was exceptionally hard because I couldn't uh, tell. Uh, there were times where I couldn't tell how many pixels this thing had because it was almost all one well, color. There was no, like no difference in it, more or less. Especially going down, going down, trying to count how many downwards was tough. But yeah, it's mostly, if not 100% pixel perfect, like 99.9% .9 pixel perfect. And I'm not counting color wise. And let's see, let's go and take a look at the top. Okay. Let's see, you're looking like that, so yeah. Almost done. That way. That way. You're not gonna cooperate, aren't you, TNT? Go forget it then. You get you guys get the idea. Now remember, turn creative mode off. Mm -hmm. When when you're done. I'll go ahead and do the same. And my game normally has a lag issue with explosives so I'll try and log back in whenever it logs me out yeah actually no I don't <clears throat> I don't think I'll turn my creative mode off that way you guys can see it exploding and that way you guys can actually see one of the TNT statues explode this time because last time with the creeper statue I was hiding <clears throat> which I will attempt to do yes um let me turn the sun up for you Thank you. Well, sunrise anyways. Come on, water. You know what? I think the next one I'll build is going to be of an Enderman. <laughs> probably. I know it's still, I know it probably won't happen because the Endermen are the tallest mobs there is, so... Either I'm going to hit the build height 
which means I'll probably won't be able to build it pixel perfect because I may hit the cut off up top there <clears throat> yeah, let's make this thing a little fancy let's have a look at what he's got going on in here got nice nice although I still say being this close mm, obsidian yeah, I'm chancing it myself but that adds the fun to it yeah obsidian obsidian and water thing may not be good enough Uh, hold on a second, stop. What am I stopping? I thought I, I, thought I heard someone outside, never mind. Alright, let's add some torches for some effects of the explosion. They're all gonna go this... They're all gonna go away at this point. Way to go, you done broke some of your thing. I can tell you right now, all the torches are going to go at this point. Point but point. I won't. I will be alive inside and the torches will be gone. Torches, yes. You, I'm going to say 9% yes. At least at this. That's why I didn't bother to build a bunker. Because I know with this many TNT, there's no way. I can be 100, 200 blocks away and I could just, might still... Here, take this torch. I'm going to need you to place that on top of this final part. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this! Okay, are you ready? Uh, not yet. That's right, turn your game... Change my game mode. Go off of creative and back into survival. I there have, we go. I, however, like I said, I will stay on survival. I mean, creative. Durr. Let's... Let's go. The TNT has been set on fire. Here we go. It should explode. There we go. For the first few seconds, uh -oh. it started to blow outwards. And now they're starting to drop, just drop down. Lag. It's like Fourth of July, only without Take the. Take but I'm not dying yet. I told you. It's like Fourth of July, only without the July and fireworks. Replace the fireworks with TNT. No, log back in. Log right. back in. You ain't got. Yeah. Oh. All the way back here. All the TNT look like they're gone, but the explosions are still going on. All the TAT are gone, but, the, but there's still explosions. What? Connection lost again? Lol. Yeah, I, I'm definitely gonna say that this TNT statue is definitely the my longest exploding one yet. Probably because, like I said, there's more TNT in it than... Is it done? What? No. No, where am I? Okay. I think it's done, ladies and gentlemen. The spawn point, which is around here somewhere, is blown up. We built our own miniature river from one. And we got a nice little. <laughs> All my torches on the inside were blown up. Yeah, and on the outside. Got a nice crater going on in here. I don't know why some TNT look like this. It's probably because of, this, of a server glitch, I guess. You can see back there, we've got some damage, got some trees missing, their leaves and bark. I think the cows are permanently frozen because of... no? Okay, good. We got... yep, we got a blast there. No, that's just a naturally spawning lava pool. Um, hmm. We have... there. That tree didn't get scaled. These, on the other hand, are missing their tree trunks and their leaves and bark.
What about over here? Yep. These are mis missing leaves and tree bark. Trunks. Over here we got some of the same damage. Now keep in mind folks, these were all all these TNT statues, the creeper statue and the TNT statue, I have some others I haven't recorded yet, were all built before 1.8, so I had to use a, so I didn't have the luxury of just going like this, I had to use a, a mod called single player uh, commands, which was, it's basically the same thing as this, except you just type in what you want, da -da 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 -da. instead of having a nice list thrown at you like this. And they'll also let you fly. Let enough mod talks. Nice little miniature man-made ravine going on there. Like I said. Let's see how far back. Looks like this is the limit right here. Yeah. That looks to be about the limit right there. All in all, pretty effective TNT. Yep. Yeah, I think the next TNT statue I'm, I'll build is of an Enderman. I don't know. I'll have to see how high I... I'm, I have, I'll have to... Oh. That's right. Uh, I may not be able to do that. Why not? Well, when I made a picture of... When I made the statue of Creeper. And the, the, a pig statue, which is going to be not filmed because I didn't fill it with TNT yet. I'll probably go back and do that later. I uh, used, again, single player commands to freeze all mobs. Mobs. That way I can go in there safely and look at them and take pictures. Seems I don't... I don't know if single player command has been updated yet. If so, then yeah, I'll go ahead and go in and get some pictures of Enderman. But, yeah, I need, like, pictures of an, all sides of the Enderman, top and bottom all four sides. Yeah, it can still be done. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I could probably find some on the internet, but not as clear and concise as what I would get from doing it myself. Anywho. Um. I still don't like the Phantom TNT look here. Yeah, that's my TNT statue, and... You did sort of survive that. Well, I'm not sure if the log out due to the end stream saved me or not, but yeah, probably. I mean, you were you said yourself you were getting hit. You were taking damage. Hmm. If if you, I mean, you did, didn't you? Yeah, I took a couple hits. It wasn't enough to kill me, but we'll see. Well, maybe if you stayed long enough, maybe you got more hits, and eventually. <clears throat> Either way, I'm here now. Excuse me. Yeah. One last look. Nice look at all the destruction and mayhem. Well, this has been one of my TNT statues. This has been Shadow of Crime and... And your survivor, Albuin saying goodbye. Peace.